the NeoDriver I2C NeoPixel board. This is the Le Potato from Libra Computing, and this can't drive NeoPixels on its own. I now have the NeoDriver board plugged in over I2C to the Le Potato, and then I have power coming from a five volt DC supply. And then I have a nice NeoPixel strip, about 60 NeoPixels plugged into these little terminal headers here. This is using Blinka, that, and rerun it. Uh, and here you go, this is not slow. Uh, at first I thought, uh-oh, this is, with all these warnings, is this gonna be disappointingly slow and we're gonna be sad? But no, I'm, I'm here on a little single board computer that can't on its own do NeoPixels, and yet with our little Neo driver, we are doing some uh, very respectable NeoPixel driving. Is the NeoDriver, it is an I2C Stemma QT NeoPixel board.